gonna take us on? Oh, my Pokemon dead. Now get ready, cause here come Rhyperira, Magmatar, and Electivire. Why are they all so hard to say? All three of them? Hey sir, no more! No more! Now what? Can I just turn him up? Uh oh. Ooh. This is gonna be oh my What the Hey, thanks for joining. So last video we quelled the frenzied electrode. And we also unlock a new map, which was the Coronet Highlands. Um, so we're going to go visit Commando Kamado and see what the next mission is. Um, I've also caught a few more Pokemon and earned another rank so that we don't have to go through all the research tasks. Let's see what he has. Um, so Warden Melly believes that the frenzies of these Pokemon are some sort of trial set by Almighty Sinnoh. We cannot know if that is the case or not, but it does beg the question, why ever would this Almighty Sinnoh drive the nobles to frenzy? Is it angered by something, or does it seek to drive a wedge between people and Pokemon? Well, far be it from us humans to fathom the thoughts of Pokemon. And what is this space-time rift anyway? What caused it to open? Um, but you must be tired. Go on, then to the Wallflower. Get some rest while you can. I've instructed Benny to prepare you his finest potato mochi. Yay! Scaling perilous heights. Also, we got a Sneezler that we can use to climb things. You've now quelled a frenzy of four nobles. On to the next one. When one of these frenzies arrive from all over Hisu, I fear that what will become of us. But here we are, already preparing to quell the final noble. What's the final noble? Yeah! Who would have dreamed some stranger who tumbled out of the sky would be our salvation? Life never does stop surprising you. The only lord left to be quelled is Avalog, which lives in the Alabaster Icelands. Oh no. He's also the largest of the nobles, according to what Irida told me. Oh no. Your mission is to quell Avalog, the final lord, and perhaps in doing so we may trigger some change in the space-time rift as well. I have no idea what to expect. Avalog may be the Pearls clan's noble, but my clan and the galaxy team will have to step up to resolve this, too, for the sake of a brighter future. Then let us all meet in the cold reaches of Alabaster Icelands, until then. Alright, so we're slumbering the Lord of the Tundra. Wow. Wow. It looks cold. I wonder if I could like ski or something. Sass! Frisk out here, isn't it? Look at what she's wearing, it's freezing! How aren't you freezing? Freezing, I'm practically sweating. If you think this is bad, just wait. This is nothing compared to where we're headed. You know, I'm, but I'm beginning to think the problem between us isn't a Diamond Clan thing or a Pearl Clan thing. It's just a you and me thing. I think they've got a thing. We'll never see eye to eye on anything, will we? I don't see how we could, as long as you and your clan cling to your vision of an almighty Sinnoh that reigns over time. Forgive, me, forgive my bluntness, but if such a being even does exist, it's certainly not almighty Sinnoh. Yes, yes. Believe what you want, just tell us where we have to go. 
We're headed to see my teacher and he's only ever found in one place. Which is? You're talking about the Garrick fellow, right? Where do we find him? At Alalag's legacy, obviously. Where else but a great mass of ice could I have meant when I said we're headed somewhere even colder? Where else, indeed? Ready to go, Sass? Yeah, just stop talking and we'll go. Sure, stomp off without me. This is why I can't stand people who only care about whether time is passing them by. See you at Abelug's legacy, Sass. Take care on your way. Okay, here we go. Oh, well, he's just wearing no shirt. Wow, that was a real slog, fighting through those miserably icy winds to reach this desolate bit of nowhere. Well done, us. This gentleman is Avalag's warden and my most honourable teacher, Garrick. So sh show some respect, Adaman. Let's begin with some proper introductions. I'm Garrick. I serve as one of the Pearl Clan's warden. And you must be Sass, right? Of the Galaxy team. Yep. Answer me this, would you? On what grounds do you come here seeking to quell Lord Avalog? Uh, he's in a frenzy? That leads to my next question. What is wrong with him being frenzied? I don't know. I don't know. Someone told me to do it. And I have another question. Setting aside any orders, what is it your heart tells you to do? To quell his frenzy! Our mighty lord of the tundra Avalag has done nothing to trouble any person or Pokemon. Sir, please try to keep your cool. For now, indeed, Avalag's causing no trouble, but aren't we also duty bound to free our people from living in fear that such a colossal Pokemon might begin to wreak havoc at any moment? We are. There is certainly some logic to that, but if that is what you hope to accomplish, then we must judge whether this child is up to the task. Who cares about the grandstanding? Let's get to battling. All right, I guess I'm gonna have to battle him. To move on to the next stage, my muscular chose as hard as and unyielding as ice. Think you can break through? He's <laughs> doing squats. Oh, I don't know what that Pokemon is. But we're gonna go Rapidash, assuming that he's just gonna send out ice Pokemon. Jeez. Okay, let's check. Uh, okay. That's super effective. Oh, rock slide. Cool. We're gonna go with strong style. Yes! Alright, time for the other one. Oh, that's nothing. I hope that didn't faint. Oh! Good! Strong style! Bam! We're done. Outstanding! I'm tough as an iceberg, but you smashed me through and through. I suppose you all can get on with it now. This one's alright. Thank you, sir. Some may still have their doubts about a stranger like Sass, but I'll vouch for her. Then you insist on quelling other lugs, Frenzy. Then you want to claim some of that eternal ice he likes and bring it to my lord's seat. Good luck. Eternal ice, is it? For that, you'll have to be able to fly, which means you'll need bravery. <gasps> I can fly! I can fly! Long story short, you've got to seek out a young lady named Sabi. Tell the long story long. You're not saving any time if we waste it by puzzling out what you mean. Isn't Avalag one of the Pearl Clan's lords? Seems a bit odd for me to do the talking. Someone just tell me. But fine, listen up. This eternal eye stuff can be found atop Avalag's legacy here. But to get there, you'll need my clan's help. Not even things like can climb this surface, let alone a person like you or me. You're going to have to approach by air, with bravery's help. Bravery. Gary one once managed to climb nearly atop Avalug's legacy. I'll let you know. He says he made it within six feet of the top. Makes, might makes right, or at least height. 
And uh, Batsabi, how do I put this? I mean, when she's not flying with Bravieri, she's got her head in the clouds. Well, you'll understand once you meet her. Head towards Snow Point Temple and you'll probably come across her sooner or later. What? What's going on? Sabi! Oh, there they are. Cool. I didn't have to go far. My clairvoyance told me that I'll lead you on a chase. Think you can reach me? Oh man! See what you meant by Sabi? But why would she be up there? Seems you better focus on pursuing Warden Sabi and let me focus on my workout while I still can. Let's see what Sabi wants. Hello, my name's Sabi. She's so cute. Nice to meet you, Sass. Same to you. No, pleasure's all mine. I've heard about you. You're super talented, right? I bet you're gonna have... You're gonna be fun to play with. I know why you're here, too. You want Braviary's help so you can quell Everlug's frenzy, don't you? Well, you'll get it. If you can catch me first. Damn it! What do you mean? I have to like chase her around? Oh. Everyone is slow except for. Oh dear. Sass! You made it all the way up here in this cold. But the question is did you catch me or did I let myself get caught? Hmm. Oh, and one more thing. Am I even really a clairvoyant? Yeah, I'm gonna say yeah. Hmm, no one but me could really know, right? Anyway, the challenge continues. The next stop of our merry chase in Snow is Snow Point Temple. But the real question here is, am I really having fun playing with you or am I bored? Hmm. Let's go, Braviary. Oh, bloody hell. Um, we're going together or? What was that? Flapping. Did she take me there? Ah, oh, boo. Okay, I'm gonna need Sneezler. Let's descend. Okay. Hi again, Sass. It's nice having someone new out here to play with, safety and numbers or something like that. Anyway, here's Snow Point Temple. I've opened the front door for you. Just a little more chasing left for you to do. But the real question here is, am I really having fun playing with you or am I bored? Hmm. Probably bored. Both. I heard what Warden Sabi said. If you have Warden Sabi's approval to enter, then by all means do so. But be warned, those who cannot solve the temple's puzzles won't get very far within. I have heard that the trick is to pay attention to which way the stone statues are looking. What statues? Come to think of it, I believe the statues have some sort of patterns on their chests too. Alright, let's see. Is it here? Uh oh, stop chasing me. I need to throw the scatter things. Ah, that didn't work. Let's get a didn't scatter all bang. makes them more angry what the heck oh, I have to go upstairs Ugh. I know oh this sucks okay Seems like I have to go to the next level. 
Let's see if this is the correct level. Oh, investigate. There are three panels fitted into the door. Each panel has a pattern carved into it. There are faint traces of words carved on the door as well. Wither, wither the statue's gaze. Which panel will you press first? Ah. Oh. Never mind, because I don't know. Now I have to go back. What's the pattern? The sun. The... How many... Hang on, what are they? It's there's rock, ice, and steel. Ah, oh, none of them is a sun. I'm gonna go. That one's rock. That's ice. That's steel. Okay, in that order. Okay, so what's that? That's rock. Okay. Rocks first. Oh, rocks there. Steel. And ice. Okay, so... I feel like it's rock, steel, ice. Because that's what I see when you... when that's what you see when you walk in. Uh, so, the rock panel, um, the steel, and the ice panel. Oof! Oh wait, I thought I did it. <laughs> it just says, you press the panels. Awesome. Uh, am I going to get stuck? Okay, solve the stone statue puzzles and make your way to Snow Point Temple top floor. Ah. Oh. Okay, where's the next one? Okay, the next one's there. Oh, I have a thing. Okay, so... Let's see, what's... Anything around here? No. Okay, so... This one is rock. Uh, ice. Steel. Rock, ice, steel. Rock. Okay. Oh, it's going to add stuff, isn't it? Ice, steel, rock. It's going to keep adding it. I'm going to have to write it down. <laughs> what? Hang on. I missed one. I missed one. There's that one. So it's rock, ice, steel, ice, rock. Yeah. All right, let's do it again. Okay. Rock, ice, steel, ice. Okay, then I'm wrong. It must be what the statues are looking at, so that's rock. Rock. A few moments later. Um, so, so I just googled what I was doing wrong. And it turns out that this one is rock, and the other one, this one, 
is ice. So my first puzzle solve in the first section was completely wrong. <laughs> um, that was a fluke. Alright, so it's ice, not rock. Ice, rock, steel, rock, ice. Ice, rock, steel, rock, ice. Ugh. Silly me. Ice, rock, steel, rock. Damn, what a fluke in the first one. That's kind of funny. Oh, gonna have to heal some Pokemon then, I guess. I feel like there's things here. Maybe a potion on... Rapidash. Okay. Hopefully that helps. Ah, bloody. I don't think I can get past. Ah! What the heck is that? A Gallade? It's level freaking 70? Okay, what's so air is super effective so let's use that bloody hell we're gonna use strong style oh so close it's gonna bloody strong style back uh, I'm fainted. Okay, so what's my... Let's hope... Slyther's got it. Ah, oh, I'm gonna have to use that. Yay! hell. Well that one's run away now. Please no more. Can I catch it? Oh rocks. Okay. Couldn't even run away from that. Oh, finally. I guess I've been caught, so we're nearly done. That's no fun. Hey, remember my clairvoyance? It showed me something else. I saw you flying with Braviary. Don't you think that'll come to pass? Do you think that'll come to pass? I'll make sure it does after all this effort. Well, however the future turns out, flying with Braviary isn't easy. If we really want to be able to fly high in the sky, prove to me you're strong enough. Gonna take us on? Oh, my Pokemon dead. Now get ready, because here come Rhyperira, Magmortar, and Elect. Why are they all so hard to say? All three of them? Bloody hell, I only have a, like a cipher. At the same time, are you freaking kidding me? Don't look at me. Alright, hang on. Let's see. Uh, let's go back. I'm gonna... Let's see how the Scyther goes. Nope. And six 
see how far it goes. Uh, it's not very effective in any of these. Alright, let's use strong style. I am not ready. Oof, so close. What the hell? Please, no more! Please, sir, no more! No more! Alright. I want my gold duck. Okay. Ah, oh, bloody hell! Okay, so... What am I... Let's get rid of this... Magma. Okay. Two more, two more. Okay. It's using Thunder Wave. Not bad. Uh, use High Horsepower. Alright, let's hope this... Come on, we can survive. Yes! I want to see how well it does high horsepower. Alright, I'm going to fight this one with strong style. Oh, so close! Oh, it high horsepowered me back! Yes! Oh no! Bloody hell! Okay! Let's go! Let's go! Okay. So... Let's use Bite. Good. Good, one more. It used Thunder Punch. Not very effective. Let's see how effective my things are. I use strong style. Oh, very close. Okay, we're gonna survive this. I use bite. Yee! Critical hit. Now my Pokemon are dead. Wow, you caught us and you beat us. You've won all our games so far. But Braviary still wants to get to know you even better up. Up to the roof we go. But I don't have anything left. Do I need to fight anyone? I'm still at this temple. I might just have to revive like, like one. Pokemon, just in case. Got heaps to revive, and we'll use it on the Rhydon because it just has so much HP. I want to be able to run faster. It's not really fast. Oh, what? Leave? Oh, that's going to the roof. Okay, we're up on the roof. Rock, rock! All right, Barrieri, why not test Sass out, test Sass's strength, test out Sass's strength for yourself? Oh no! I knew it! Uh, do I have to... Bloody hell. Okay, well luckily... I only have a Rhydon. And let's see how a Rhydon goes. 
All right, rock slide's really good. Can rock slide get me where I need to be? We're gonna strong style it. Yes! Girl, I can't believe Barbary lost. But that's that. Thanks for playing with me. Guess I'll head home now. Bye. No, 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 no. Wait. I was kidding. Play along with me on your flute. Yes. Yes, I can fly. Yes, we can fly! Yay! Yay! Yes, probably open his heart and learn well to the sound of your playing. Yes! You received the sky plate. Yay! Okay, so we're gonna fly! Have a look at the seas down there. Okay. Now, go get a feel for flying with bravery. When you're done soaring skies and want to land, just ask him to dive. Yay! Yes! I'm so excited. Oh my god, that's so cool. Uh, how do we... Okay, let's... Good, we're going a bit faster. Oh, we're not diving yet. Now what? Can I just turn him up? Uh oh. Did I just hurt myself? Uh oh. Ah oh, man! I got lost 10! Oh man! Oh, I lost my black ogre And six potions! Oh, bloody hell. Should have learned how to fly properly. Seems you were rescued. Ah, uh, at least things were. Oh man. Now. Okay. Good. Now, did I lose my satchel here? Somewhere? Nah. That's the first time I've fainted like that. Now what? Investigate. Your arc phone is beeping. You obtain a piece of eternal ice. Ooh. Ah! How did he get up there? At last, this summit is conquered. I see you made it too. Flew down to this place and obtained the eternal ice, did you? What drives that burning zeal of yours, I wonder? You gave Garrick the eternal ice. I do have to respect the effort you've put in. I still may have my own doubts weighing on my mind, but I will make the necessary preparations so that you can face my lord, Abelard. Meet me at Ice Peak Arena. Noise. Now, don't try to repeat the wondrous feat that you're about to see me perform. A tall leap like this can only be managed by highly toned bodies like mine. Till next we meet. Alright, well let's go. Let's see if I can fly there.
How good? I'm flying! Oh, the last, this is the last noble. It's gonna be super difficult. I mean, Electrode in the last video was just so difficult. <laughs> this is gonna be, oh my, what the? Frick! Are you kidding me? Oh my god. That's a giant. That's a god. That's not a Pokemon. Can I jump on the ice? No, I can't. What the heck? Oh shit! What the? Ah! Oh! How are you meant to survive that? I... Oh, that was really bad. Oh, <laughs> I did. That wasn't even a, that wasn't even easy. Okay. Oh. Are you even reaching it? Oh, bloody hell. Sitting Pokemon when I can't even survive. Ah, oh. this is this. I might need to regroup and just. Chill out. Oh, I have a large barrage of attacks he's gone going. Concentrate on dodging and wait for your chance to strike back. The powerful beam that Avalog launches from his maw can be evaded with the Y button if you use your brief window of invulnerability to dodge straight through it. Alright, let's continue battle. I haven't made much progress anyway, so might as well just keep progress. This is ridiculous. How do you even? Ah.
Okay. Alright, we got... We got this far. Now, let's see what's good. Scyther's not very effective. Rhydon's effective. Okay, Golduck's effective. Ah, oh, man, I thought Fire-type was going to be effective. Okay, cool. I thought it was a snow one. We're just going to use strong style. Oh, oh I was in the way. Could use Earth power. I need to move out of the way. Okay, Rabidash is gone. Uh, we're going to use Rhydon. Okay, so... Let's check... Scott. Ooh, can I use... Oh no, that's not very effective. Let's use Strong Style and hope we get it to faint! Oh no! Okay, Blizzard, let's hope it's not going to do too much. Bloody hell! Go duck! We can do this. I use strong style. Yay! Okay, all right, we got, we did really well. That was really good. Okay, so, oh, my heart, <laughs> we're having a heart attack. <laughs> okay, uh, leafage is super effective. I don't know why I threw out that one, but we're gonna, we're just gonna have to just get it down to whatever we can. Oh, that didn't do much at all. Oh, man. Oh, man. Uh, go, Duck. Go, Duck, you can do this. We're going to use Water Pulse. Please, please, faint it. Please, one shot. Yes, yes! Yes! No, 
I died. <gasps> yes! Yes! <laughs> okay, that was so much easier than Electrode. Let me tell you, Electrode was a pain! Okay, I'm so happy. There was like little gaps in there that really, really helped. Garrick, sir, you needn't look so quite downcast, but seeing Almighty Overlord quelled and by such a slight child, a child that fell from the very sky, is this Saskel some kind of monster in disguise? She is no monster. She's the one who risked her life without a second thought in order to call our frenzied suffering nobles. Sass, Eric cares for the Pearl Clan with all his heart and believes in Almighty Sinnoh just as deeply. So he has feared more than any of us that getting involved with the Diamond Clan and your galaxy team could cause our people to flag in their devotion to Almighty Sinnoh. But that will change. Hey Rita? I know your fears will change once you see what Sass, see what I've seen. Sass has much to teach us. She's shown us how to overcome, how we can overcome all manner of strife, so long as our Pokemon are with us. She's made me want to help Glaceon realize greater strength as well, and to see my whole world grow broader. It seems you've already changed, Rita. I knew you could pull that off, Sass. Okay, you called the very last Frenzied Noble. So is that space-time rift going to start closing up or what? I'm sure there's more stuff to deal with. There's little way of knowing for sure, though the rift does seem perhaps a little smaller somehow. Let's hope so anyway. Well, with any luck, things will settle down now. Although, even if the rift does start spitting out more of that strange lightning, we should still be alright as long as we've got sass. Indeed we should be. It's good to have her at our side. You know something, Arita? We may never agree on what's got it, who's got it right about Almighty Sinnoh, but you Pearl Clown folk aren't all bad in my book. Look who's finally seen reason. Anyway, now that we've called the last noble, I see we pay grim old Commander Kamado a visit and see if he'll finally crack a smile for us. Okay, so report to Commander Kamado that you have accomplished your mission. Oh my goodness! Yes! That was so good! Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.